company, really, same as everybody else. You know, it's uh, we, we have a business to run. People have got less money to spend. All their produce is going up uh, constantly. You know, prices have doubled with you know veg, potatoes, anything like that. But we're you know too scared to put things up. So you're constantly cutting what profit you're making, but obviously trying to strive to keep the quality there. But it, you know, in the current climate, it's just extremely difficult. You just find it all the time. But I, well, I feel it's getting worse from where, where we have the main shop. Uh, we had 5,000 people on our doorstep, if you will. It's, it's a community of, you know, it's all businesses where we are. There were maybe five, 6,000 people there five years ago. We're down to a 1,000 now because since we took over, Citibank went bump in the States. I think it's in existence, but they left nearly 1,000 staff. Exxon Mobil were on site. It was their European call centre, some 700 staff. They weren't even halfway through their lease. They uprooted and moved the European call centre to Guatemala. The only reason being the average wage in Guatemala is circa 400 quid a month. Where, so you can see the same straight away. ExxonMobil are a global company. They have no reason to stay in Britain. So again, then people moved out overnight and it, that has just been the trend. Office space is everywhere. It's very competitive, so if they can get better deals elsewhere or even in another country, that's what they're going to do. You know, even in my situation, trying to get the rates cheaper because we've lost so much business, the council, whilst they lend you a, 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 an ear or a shoulder to cry on, they won't reduce anything. So you're constantly having to battle all the time. So we're down to say a thousand people on our doorstep now, and there's two uh, cafes, coffee shops fighting for that business as well as a news agent post office that also sells sandwiches so you're constantly trying to reinvent the wheel but with less money so it's just a, a battle from Monday to Friday every week.